Lou Carosillo wrestling for Gettysburg. He's going to face off against Troy Stanich coming into this. Stanich is 20-0. and 0. He's a sophomore who only has one loss in his college career. That was it came in the national tournament last year where he finished third as a freshman. Certainly a talented young guy. He gets the two there on Lou. Coming in as Lou is 10 and 10 on the year. With six pin victories, major decision. Stanish looks to his coach for a little bit of education here with two minutes and 14 to go in the first. He's got the 2 0 lead early. Stanish does have that the unorthodox referee's position of both knees again. Trying to control the head and the forearm of Corsillo. Trying to walk over, stack him a little bit. Luke can turn around if he can, get a switch. Good job by Stanich following. Stanich showed earlier in his match against McDaniel that he has super, very good hips. As he followed his opponent all the way around. As Eckenbarger, who is no slouch himself, tried to roll around and get away from him. The very good fundamentals of Troy Stanich. Stanix comes from Roxbury, New Jersey, not to, not to be confused with Roxbury, Massachusetts, home of New Edition, the band. Fifty-one seconds to go. Stanix has the riding time. He tried to get a little two there. Sucks back, Lou Carasillo. Of course, it's not a position where he'll pin him, but he can certainly get his four. See what he gives him. He does give him the four. That's six. Six zero for Troy Stanich right now, with 33 seconds to go in the first. He's got the far side half. Near side chicken wing, I believe. Going to try to walk him over again. Jumps over. He's got an underhook. Might try to suck him back again, or try to turn him around. Lou fights back up to his base, trying to fight those hands. A little bit of a roll for a tilt is Stanich. Lou trying to fight away. But he's going to get the tilt as the time expires, and he gets his four there. So it's going to be 10-0 going into the second period. Stanich has two minutes and 28 seconds of riding time. Stanish right now is ranked at number one in the country by D3 Wrestle. <laughs> That's one of three of the Ducks to be ranked in the top three of the country. Brett Kaliner, the 141, is ranked number one. Of course, he, he's not wrestling today. Zach Wilhelm at 157 is ranked number three. Stanish has won his last 21 matches. 22 now after his victory against McDaniel. He got the two points there against Carosillo, of course, with one minute to go in the second period. Controlling the head, trying to look for a tech fall. Most likely he can get that if he gets four points a near fall. Kind of call a stalemate, 40 seconds to go.
standing still controlling the head trying to turn carousel here carousel try to fight away not get the, the tech fall call with 18 to go in the second period no near fall points given 10 to go in the second period Stanis now is locked up his riding time. He's got three minutes and 50 seconds of it. He's got some back points now. That riding time might not be worth it. The four points given there, so that's going to be a tech fall victory for Troy Stanis. Another strong showing from him. 23 straight matches won by the sophomore.